Walking across the ice here, probably not the best idea, but it is what it is. My self-reliant style. I am a mix of primitive hunting and gatherer skills with 21st century innovations. I can hunt, I can forge, I can fish, I can trap. From a little kid, like six years old, I was always in my back forest. I just had this infatuation and this this calling to, to be out in nature. All I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use this water vine to hold the walnut so I can crack it. There you go. I'll make a spruce needle tea, pine needle tea, and they have high amounts of vitamin C, vitamin A, vitamin B. I hunt usually with a bow. I've eaten frogs, garter snakes, squirrels, possum, raccoon. If you're that hungry, you, you'll eat just about anything. So this is a very active squirrel hole. Could be dinner tonight. I do believe in using every scrap of that animal. I use any guts for bait for other traps. Bones become tools. Eating the bones, then you can crack them and you chew down the marrow. I'm just gonna be making a pot hook. The longest amount of time that I've spent out in the wild was 32 days. So I almost have a full pot of water from the snow melting. I'd be leaving behind my girlfriend, my parents, my brother, <laughs> and most importantly is my, my black lab. How I deal with the loneliness is keeping myself occupied. Have a quick thought about home, good. Start doing something. You go out and you chop a bunch of firewood for the night. It's just a simple bush chair. This is my life, this is my passion. I'm quiet, I'm stealthy, I'm, I'm on my A game. It's like a mix between hail and rain, so I'm just trying to get this fire going while I still have time. Alone at last. It's scary out here in these woods. My stomach is in knots.